Today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Onesimus. Saint Onesimus, a pagan, was a slave in the household of the wealthy Philemon, converted by Saint Paul, presumably during his long stay at Ephesus in Turkey. Philemon had become a close friend of Paul's. Thus, when Philemon moved to the city of Colosse, his new home was chosen as a meeting place for Christian worship. One day, Onesimus, apparently in fear of being punished for some act of negligence or dishonesty, had escaped to Rome, where he came in contact with Paul, who was suffering his first imprisonment in Rome. After due instruction in the faith, Paul baptized him. Onesimus, for his part, true to his name, proved so very useful that Paul took a great liking to him and wanted to keep him as a helper. However, he was conscious of the fact that as a slave, Onesimus would first have to make restitution to his former master. And so, Paul sent him back to Philemon with the famed epistle to the latter, pleading with him like a father for his spiritual son and treating him to accept Onesimus no longer as a slave but more than a slave, a brother. Philemon, upon receiving the letter, acceded to the great apostle's request with true Christian generosity and charity, and he even surpassed it by not only pardoning but even freeing his former slave and sending him back to Rome, where he is supposed to have assisted Paul for some time and then returned to the East with him after his release. Tradition also has it that Onesimus in later years became Bishop of Brehoria in Macedonia and there he suffered martyrdom.